I, I lift the spirits of my students every day. That's my goal. When a child walks into my room, I want them to leave happier than they arrived. I want them to learn something, but I want them to feel powerful. I want them to walk out knowing that they did everything they could that day to become a smarter global citizen. My hope is that I'm lifting their spirits so that when they leave, they feel empowered. As a principal, I really enjoy having a teacher like Janet, who, who I know I can count on. Um, she sets the bar high, and we do, at Forest Lakes, we do strive for excellence in everything we do. She is a good example of that and helps bring recognition to all of us at Forest Lakes Elementary. Uh, the Presidential Award for Excellence in Mathematics and Science Teaching is given to uh, two teachers in each state every year. One teacher receives the award for science teaching, the other for math teaching. I received the award for uh, science teaching in the state of Florida and basically it's an award from the president acknowledging excellence in what I do in the classroom in science. I was nominated by a dear friend who actually at one time was my intern here at Forest Lakes Elementary and she has since gone on to become uh, a professor at Penn State University. She also was a teacher in Pinellas County. I think what makes this award special for me is the fact that it validates my thoughts on how to teach science to children and what needs to be taught. I also have a passion for science and so this validated what I was doing already and made me feel as if, yes, you're doing a good job. Being a presidential awardee comes with a great deal of responsibility because I see it as a means to an end. My end being that I want to leave something behind, my mark on education as a whole. And so being a presidential awardee, they come back to you and they do ask you to attend a variety of different panel meetings, sometimes sit on committees at both the state and national level. Uh, recently I actually went to Tallahassee and met with the governor and was able to share my ideas about what science education should look like in both Pinellas County and around our state and possibly the nation and hoping that uh, as I give my ideas and tell about what teachers are doing and I like to use the term in the trenches and the people who are really doing the work uh, should be the ones given the ideas. So this award gives me that opportunity to share my thoughts and the thoughts of others as I collaborate and get their ideas uh, about teaching. I think it's important to remember that children are born with a natural curiosity about the world around them. And science is that conduit that we can all use to make every child successful. So I think that we need to use science as the starting point to bring our young people to school excited, enthusiastic, wanting to learn, and then we can take it from there to integrate all of the other subject matter. 